Here are some quick snapshots of animals available for adoption at the Willamette Humane Society in Salem, Oregon. Hi, I'm Trish, a volunteer at the Willamette Humane Society, and this beautiful black and white girl is Bonnie. Bonnie's a seven-year-old cat, and has been referred to by staff here as our little kitty bear, because Bonnie's a rather substantial little cat, but she's lovey and cuddly. And Bonnie's here with us because she was surrendered by her family. They were moving and couldn't take her with them. And she is just a love. Look at how calm she is, and now she's cuddling. So if you would like a big, fluffy lap cat, come to the Willamette Humane Society and visit with Bonnie. Hi, come join the fun. This is Dee Dee. Dee Dee is a two-year-old female terrier mix. She's probably got some pit in her, but she has just got a lot of love in her. She's just sweet, she knows sit. She came to us um, through a court order, so she, uh, we're not sure a lot about her, but we do know that she had a pretty good home. She definitely um, needs to lose a little weight, so she's had a lot of food. And she's very sweet natured. She's a little bit on the shy side, so maybe when you come to meet her, it might take her a minute or three <laughs> to um, warm up to you. But she's a very sweet girl. She's just very happy. She's all the time um, wagging her tail. Yes, she oh. And she's very, very friendly. She just loves everybody, doesn't mess with other dogs. She's been raised with other dogs. She's good around all kinds of people. She's just as friendly as she could be. Um, and she's a nice size, and she's energetic, and she's polite. She's just a lot of fun. Hi, my name is Kathy, and I'm a volunteer at the Willamette Humane Society. And this little guy is happy. Happy is part Siamese, as you can tell. Uh, he's about three years old, and he was brought to us because his owners moved. So he needs a new home. He's actually a little nervous right now, but he's really a very easygoing, lovable guy. Um, he's lived with other cats before. He's even lived with ferrets. So he gets along with, with everybody, and uh, I think a family with children five and older would be perfect for him. So I hope you will come visit Happy and some of our other animals at the Willamette Humane Society. Hi there, I'm here with Cedar, and he's an American Staffordshire Terrier mix. Uh, he's seven months old, and in being so young, uh, he could use. Uh, he's very very active, and therefore could use some of the training classes. Uh, we have here at the Humane Society. Um, he's an ideal candidate for a, 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 like a young couple or a home where he's gonna get a lot of activity and running around. Uh, maybe not the best for, <laughs> for young, young kids or toddlers, but definitely for older kids. Um, as you can see, he's not uh, being too active right now, but um, if you would like a, a forever companion, uh, come check out Cedar today. Hi, my name's Benet, a volunteer with the Willamette Humane Society, and this is my bunny friend, Bradley. Bradley is new to the Humane Society. He came from us as a stray. He's been living life on the streets, so he's a little bit shy at first, but once he gets to know you, he loves having his cheeks pet. Bradley would probably do best because he's a little shy with a, in a home with no younger children. Um, probably about five or older would be okay, but he really is what wants to be the one bunny around. So bonding him would not be a good option, but if you had another bunny, it would probably be okay in a separate cage. Bradley definitely loves his treats, his shredded wheat and some yogurt drops, and of course his fresh fruits and vegetables. He really loves broccoli. If you think you might be interested in meeting Bradley and seeing what a wonderful bunny he truly is, come on down to the bunny room. Hi, my name is Arielle, and I'm here with Cookie today. And she's a very sweet, sophisticated lady. And she's four years old, and she's an Australian cattle dog mix. 
As you can see, she's very interested in my treats that I have here. But she's very intelligent. She's good with um, tricks and look at how like focused she is. She's gonna be really easy to teach. She's gentle when she eats. Um, she's really good on a leash and with other dogs and all that kind of stuff. Um, she, she has had some problems though with cats. She's pretty fond of chasing those cats and she's jumped some fences for it. So definitely um, the house that she's going into would need like big fences and definitely no cats. She has lived with kids before, um, over five, so anything that's, you know, any kids are pretty much probably going to be good with her. She's not so fond of more rough treatment, so just, she needs to be in a home that knows that and understands that she's just kind of, you know, a little on the gentler side. She likes being treated nicely. After all, she is a lady. Hi, I'm Trish, a volunteer at the Willamette Humane Society, and this handsome guy is McCormick. Isn't he gorgeous? Look at the side of him. McCormick is here because he was picked up as a stray, and we think he's about two years old. He's very lively, but he's very loving. He'd, he'd do well in a home with a, a little older children, partly because he is so lively. He would make a good friend and a good lap cat when he calms down and after the end of a day of hard playing. So if you think McCormick would make a good addition to your family, come to the Willamette Humane Society and visit with him. Got a cute little jumping bean chihuahua mix. Isn't he cute? This is John Paul. John Paul is five and he's so much fun. We gave him a bath yesterday and he's so fluffy and he doesn't even hate me. <laughs> he just wants to be carried. You know, he's oh, he's only 11 pounds. He is really a cuddler and a kissing machine. He definitely loves to be kissed. He is just perfect for someone who wants a small traveling companion. If you've got a motor home or you've got um, people who are on the go and you want to just tuck this dog under your arms, he loves to be carried. He's house trained. He's never really lived around cats. Oh, he likes treats. And that's what I have right here in my back. Here, I'll turn around. There you go. Take that treat, you cutie. Yeah. He's very good on a leash. He stays right with you, and he'd actually prefer to be picked up. Now, let's turn you around so that they can see you. Oh, he's found. Oh, yes. He says, I got some treat. Okay, I have a treat right here. And let me turn around so that they can see how cute you are. Okay, good. Yeah. Oh, can you jump up there? Oh, good. He would be so easy to train. Hi, I'm back, and this time I have Mozart with me. Mozart is three years old, and as you can see, he's a beautiful cat. He would, uh, has a coat that needs a lot of good care, but he is lovely, and he loves to sit on laps. Doesn't like to be carried around so much, but he does like to sit and be petted. Um, he was found and brought to us. Um, but he has lived with other cats before, and they think he would be great with children, at least ages five and older. And we hope you will come visit Mozart and some of our other Cats at the Willamette Humane Society. We hope you enjoyed meeting some of the animals available for adoption at Willamette Humane Society. If you're interested in learning more about any of the pets you saw in today's show, go to our website at www.willamettehumane.org. You'll find photos, profiles, and detailed information about all available animals. You can also learn about upcoming events and classes, how to become a volunteer, make a secure online donation, and more.